extended gameplay. Ooh, I am looking forward to this. Looking for, this is loud. I am looking forward to this. Hi, my name is Philip Jusham, senior producer on Dead Space. Today, I'm That's here so to give you a first look at one of my favorite sections in the game. So we find ourselves here in the Ishimura's hangar at the beginning of chapter three. We're going to make our way towards the control room in the engineering, where we'll attempt to restart the ship's engine. Textures on the bus, the on his, on his For those of you who remember the original, the hangar was much smaller than it is now. That looks so good. We get to explore this location and literally fly through it before heading to our destination. I hope it's 60 frames on PS5. I don't know if they've confirmed that or not. Navigating between chapters without load screens or having a camera cutaway is part yeah, of how we've so. reimagined the Ishimura for the remake. We don't need to rely on the tram as the sole way to get between chapters. Wow. It is now a seamless, interconnected ship. Yes. Entering vacuum. Definitely spent time on the sunlight. Yeah. Opened it up a it's, it's a lot better. It's, it's night and day nice. difference. Back on the PS3 is when I played it. Yeah. We've got two lurkers wow, here. Put all the frozen on you his can suit. quickly that get rid really of them good. with a pulse rifle or Isaac's trusty plasma cutter. Nice. There aren't many traditional firearms on board. To survive, you may have to improvise and choose how to take each necromorph down. Oh. We're now entering the ship. We have a lot to show you, so let's skip ahead to chapter three. <laughs> We've just received a briefing to head over to the refueling station. Look at it, the atmosphere. To get there, we're it's passing really through the machine it. shop over here. I'm just, I'm just wondering, why is he walking like that? If you so, needed to backtrack or simply wanted effect. to explore the ship further, you may encounter a completely different is experience. It mirrors this video is super dark. It's dark. Different enemies. The ambience and lighting may change. This is cough. what we call the intensity director. It keeps the issue more unpredictable and brings some additional tension and I'm charm. Have to shoot that. Let's kill it off. Oh, it's having dead shit. I like the brutal enemies in this game. The way they move is crazy. Like the way to the station you. is just a little further ahead. As you can see, some memorable moments are authentic to the original. It's mainly textures. We've added tons of graphical enhancement that support strategic dismemberment. Using Kinesis, we'll bring that gondola over and make our way to the south refueling station. I think it's nostalgia for me as well. Like, yeah. I did like it when it first came out. We need it to gain access to the fuel well. management office, which contains the power functions for the refueling station. We can follow that cable to find our way there. One of the things we tried to achieve was oh. to add more context to the various objectives, to expand on what was there and bring a bit more detail and depth where we could. Yeah. We've definitely put a lot of detail into it now. I don't remember it looking this dark on previous videos, though. Is it worth really this dark? Yeah. I haven't changed anything with the settings. So let's just be there. Their video or the game gets off. The refueling station has no power. We can look for a way to access the fuel management office. Lighting, man. This card should allow us in, and we can now make our way back. Isaac, Hammond, Daniels, you made it. Thank God. After the bridge, we thought. We'd... Glad to disappoint. I barricaded myself in the computer core. I can hear them, but. I don't think they know I'm here. Isaac, I tracked down your rig. You're an engineer, right? I'll get myself admin privileges. Maybe I can help. Now that we have access to this room, we're faced with a very tough choice. Uh -oh. We could cut power to life support and rely on air canisters for oxygen, but today we'll play a section without lights instead. <laughs> oh, nice. Oh, this is right, down, right up your alley, this yeah. game. It is. You love getting terrified. 
for some reason. <laughs> Love that weapon, man. It's just so unique. With the power restored, the South refueling station can now be activated. I wonder if they're going to put some sort of like guide map. Well, you get the the line that kind of directs you. In the decontamination room, using new tech, we've cranked up the tension. <clears throat> Dynamic smoke creates that thick and opaque atmosphere that makes you lose track of the lurkers, even when they're right next to you. Uh, 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 uh. Ah! Yeah. <laughs> it it, Zed. Yeah, I love stomping the enemies and just smashing them to bits. It adds to the claustrophobia, the feeling of being locked in with a pack of necromorphs. Necromorphs. Yeah, you do get a sense of claustrophobia in this game. Where's the next one? There's gotta be one more. There you go. Whoa. Our last stop is a centrifuge. It's oh, offline, and the Ishimura is getting dragged down to the planet below. Oh, what a big difference. We've added so much detail in here. Looks yeah. way Particle scarier. Effects, lighting, floating debris. We wanted this room to be imposing and tell a story at the same time. It's a lot more impressive, and its size makes it harder to keep track of the incoming necromorphs. So audio plays a huge role here in identifying the direction of threats. With one of the generator modules back in place, we can head to the second one. Look at the difference. Flying in zero-g and not being so anchored to the surface detail. makes spatial awareness It just makes the game feel Combat different. Combat encounters can quickly become <clears throat> deadly. Oh, it makes the game more feel. Yeah, it just feels different. <laughs> like, oh. Yeah, it feels, feels different. So it makes the game feel filled. <laughs> and more now, filled. with the generator modules filled. powered up, the centrifuge is ready to be activated. Generator module attached. Clutch engaged. All personnel clear for centrifuge restart. I hope you enjoyed this sneak peek at the new Dead Space. Thank you for tuning in. Yes, no, thank you. That, that cleared up quite a bit of stuff for us, like wondering what it looks like in the actual game, in yeah. dark places and stuff like that, yeah. Uh, it's man, a lot it's... more... Like, it would be a lot more enjoyable. Because... <laughs> mm. Just the little details make it. I was gonna play it again, the original on on Steam, yeah. Yeah. But now I'm just gonna wait for the, yeah. the remake. Oh, we we could play it offline and then maybe play the original, obviously online, and then we can compare the difference. Yeah. Offline, online. Yeah. <laughs> I just wait for the remake. We'll play it on the channel. Mm -hmm.